free. Welcome to Fit Class. This is going to be a quick 35 minute class. Um, if you have a set of weights at home, that's fantastic. You can use those. If not, know that you can use whatever you have um, at home throughout this workout. We're going to go ahead and get started. Maybe at the top of your mat, feet step out wide to the sides of your mat. Lengthen your arms long beside you. Take it down to the left. Rise tall. and Inhale, lower down. Tap it to the right. Lift and squeeze your shoulder blades together at the back. Slide thin through your knees. We're going to warm up through our lower body. And start to feel the torque and the twist through your core. Inhale, lower, tap your feet down. Exhale, lift, grow tall. Elongate through the crown of your head at the top. You've got it just for five more. We take this right into alternating knee pulls in three, just two, and one. You've got it, stand tall, drag your right knee up, flex your toes. Drop it down and release, drag your left knee. Release it down. Fierce flex through your toes, pull your knee, hug it up into your chest. Continue to engage through your core. Activate through your biceps as you drag your knee up. You've got this. Inhale, lower, release. Exhale, lift and drive. Just for four more. You've got this for three. We take this right into slow and controlled butt kicks in two and one. You've got to pump your arms next to your side. Start to flex through your toes. Drive your heels towards your glutes. You've got this. Take this at your own pace. Maybe you just step it out side to side and quicken up the pace as you can, as you feel able to. You've got this right here, 10 more seconds. Deep inhale, sharp exhales. Yes, you can, still warm it up through your entire body. Whew, you can, maybe you take your hands up for the last 10 seconds. Oh yeah, you guys look so good at home. Stay with me for five. You can just for four, three, two, and one. Walk it all the way down, find your high plank. Hold right, your shoulders stack over your wrist. Micro bend through your elbows, then hinge forward, just slightly take a deep breath in. Exhale, downward facing dog. We pull through this and no gaze forward. High plank. Exhale, down dog. Feel the stretch through the backs of your legs. Inhale forward. Exhale, press it back. Heels filter, melt down into your mat. Relax the tension in the back of your neck for three. You've got to hold your high plank in two. And one, hold your high plank alternating shoulder taps. Tap up to the right, up to the left. Know that you can always drop down to your knees in this position and alternate right here. Maintain the hinge forward through your upper body. Little tap, release, squeeze. You've got it just for five more seconds. Whew, we pop up on our feet in four. We're gonna get this party started in three, just two, and one. Pop up on your feet, capture both of your weights. We just kick it off right here with a wide squat knee drive. Inhale, lower down. Exhale, lift, drive it up. Inhale, lower. Exhale, lift. You've got this opposite elbow drives towards opposite knee. Actively press your weights up at center, shoot your elbows out wide. You've got a deep squat, deep twist. Chest up, chin up the entire time. As you lower down, stack your shoulders over your hips. You've got this first active move of the day. You've got this inhale, lower. Exhale, lift, continue to engage your core right here. Know that you can take this with two weights, one weight, no weights at all. Focusing on your lower body, deep lower. Deep lift and, lift and twist as you tap into your obliques. Inhale, lower down. Exhale, lift, just for four. Stay tall in three. Capture your weights if you don't have them in two. And one, stay tall. Elbows come right to 90 degrees. Inhale, lower. Exhale, lift, front shoulder press. Calf raise. Whew. As you punch your weights up towards the ceiling, maintain a slight bend through your elbows. Weight step directly above your shoulders. Inhale, lower, down to 90. Exhale, lift, grow tall. Start to engage through your calves as you lift your heels high. Maintain your micro bend through your knees. Hips press forward. You've got this, inhale, lower. Exhale, lift, still warming up for our first round. One count down, one count up. Deep inhale, sharp exhales. It's gonna help power you through this entire move. You've got five more. Yes, you can. We ditch our weights in four. For three, just two. And one, ditch your weights, top of your mat, lower all the way down to your stomach. You've got super people. Inhale, lower. Exhale, lift. Whew, one count down, one count up. Gaze is down, palms face down, shoulder blades squeeze behind you. Yes, you've got it, one count down. One count up, maybe find a pause at the top. Slow this motion down just a little bit. Slow your breath, focus in on your movements, inhale lower, exhale lift. Yes, you can. Stay strong through this. Emphasize the action on your back. One count down, one count back and squeeze. Hollow through your core. Yes, 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 stay with me. You can for five. Pop it up on your feet in four. Just three for two. 
and one. Pop it up on your feet, capture both of your weights, press your weights at heart center. Alternating reverse lunges, inhale, lower down, right foot goes back. Step it together, lower down with your left. Step it together, you've got it, inhale, lower. Exhale, lift. See if you can stay low through your legs as you switch your legs out. You can find a chair position to move your lower body. You've got this knees and toes point straight ahead. Maybe you drop your weights down to your side. Lower down, lift it up. Back knee can come to a hover. Back heel comes up and over the balls of your foot. You've got this, inhale, lower down. Exhale, lift at the top. Deep inhale, sharp exhales. You guys look so good at home. Trust yourself, trust this process. Yes, you can, give me five. Stay strong just for four. Hold at the top of your mat in three. Just two. And one, hold at the top of your mat. Hinge forward just slightly. Weights tap together. Reverse chest fly, inhale to prepare. Exhale, lift and squeeze. Inhale, lower down. Exhale, lift. Yes, you can micro in through your elbows. I'm gonna take it to a side view for your anchor. Whew, one count down. One count up and back. Notice how I stay stationary through my lower body and super tight through my core. One count down. Drive and squeeze at the back. Maybe you find a pause. The slower, the better through this movement. You've got this. Maybe you have two weights. Maybe you have no weights at all. Whatever you do, keep on breathing, keep on moving. Power through this exercise, power through this posture. One count down. One count back and squeeze. Yes, you can. You've got 10 more reps right here. Can you just take one inch lower and hold through your legs? Oh yeah, I see you guys at home. Give me five. We drop down to our mats in four. Just three for two. And one, ditch your weights down to your mat, rock and roll all the way down to your back. You've got crunches. Plant the palms, your feet down on your mat. Fingertips come behind your ears. Inhale to prepare. Exhale, crunch up. Inhale, lower. Exhale, lift you back. Chest up, chin up. Take your gaze up towards the ceiling. Whew, leave space between your chin and your chest. Just a simple crunch up right here. Belly button melts down into your spine. Melt your bow back down into your mat. Whew, you've got this. And then actively press through the palms of your feet in your mat. Feel the engagement through your quads all the way up into your low core. Inhale, lower, slow and controlled. Exhale, crunch up. Inhale, lower. Exhale, crunch and squeeze. Yes, 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 you've got this. Stay strong. We pop it up to our feet in five. You can grab your weights, pop it up to your feet in three. Just two and one, pop it all the way up to your feet. You've got a reverse bicep curl, inhale lower. Exhale, curl. Plus a narrow squat, inhale lower down. Exhale lift, once you've got your reverse bicep curls down, add your narrow squat, inhale lower. Exhale lift, lower and lift. The difference between your bicep curl here is that your palms and your weights are gonna face down. Drive your weights up towards your shoulders. Yes. Ooh. Sometimes we abandon the opposite sides of our forms. We've got this, inhale, lower. Exhale, lift. Start to glue the weight back into your heels. Start to flex up through your toes just slightly. And as you lower down, shoot your glutes towards the back of your room. Oh yeah, notice how you can sink just a little bit lower by just making that simple adjustment. One count down. One count up, you've got this. Ooh. Start to burn out through your biceps. Inhale, lower. Exhale, lift. Stay with me, you are strong enough. You can handle this right here. Sink a little bit lower through your narrow squats. All oh, yeah, lift a little bit higher through your reverse bicep curl. You can for four. Stay strong for three. Just two. And one, exhale your weight to heart center. Lunge it back, knee drive it up. You got it just on the right side, inhale lower. Exhale, lift. Ground down through your left foot. Drive through your right, inhale lower. Back knee, right knee comes to a hover. Flex through your toes, drive your knee up to your chest. Actively press your weights at heart center. You've got a little tap back knee to a hover. Exhale, lift and drive, knee comes up to your chest. One count down, one count up. You've got this deep inhale, sharp exhales. Can you see just a little bit lower through your left leg? Lift a little bit higher through your upper body with your weights. We switch our sides in five. Oh yeah, switch your sides in four. Just three for two, and one, switch your sides, pinch your right foot down, left foot drives back, inhale lower. Exhale, lift, knee drive, lower down. Lift and squeeze, lower down. Lift and squeeze. Yes, 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 stay with me. Can you sink even lower on this side? Lift your knee just a little bit higher, finding even more flex through your toes. Stay with me. Biceps are still active, pressure weights at heart center. You've got it, inhale lower. Exhale, lift. 
just for five. Ditch your weights, top of your mat in four. Weights are ditched in three. Just two and one. Ditch your weights, top of your mat. Girthies, you've got it. And he'll lower it down. Option to add a push up right here. Hop it all the way up. Who reach for the stars and how lower? Exhale, lift. Yes, yes, yes. Find the beat of the music right here. Dig just a little bit deeper. Push yourself just a little bit harder. This is your very first intense cardio rest of the day. Give it all you've got. You don't have a ton of cardio. So trust yourself, you've got 10 more seconds. Maybe you add in a push up for your last few rounds. Maybe you take it just a little bit higher at the top. Oh, yeah, you guys look so good. Give me five. Find your high plank in four, high plank in three. Just two and one. Hold your high plank 10 seconds. Whew, shoulders over your wrist. Gaze goes at the top of your mat. And then hinge forward just slightly for five, four, three, two, and one. Exhale, drop your knees down. You've got a 30 second break. Grab a sip of water, grab whatever you need, and then we're gonna take it right into round two. Whew, little step together. Jack it out. Maybe you grab a sip of water. Towel off. Maybe you're doing this with somebody on FaceTime. Tell them they've got this. We're gonna take it right into round two and five. Grab your weights in four, just three, two, and one. You've got to grab your weights. Take your knees and your toes straight ahead. You've got a narrow squat, lateral arm raise. Narrow squat down, lateral arm raise. Weight stop right at your shoulders. Maintain a micro in through your elbows. Stay super strong through your upper body, through your core. Yes, if you start to feel yourself hinging forward through your narrow squat, roll your shoulders up and back, relax the weight back into your heels. Yes, nice adjustments, inhale, lower, narrow squat. Exhale, lift, lateral arm raise. Whew, I know this can start to really fatigue through your arms, so focus in on your breath, focus in on your exhales as you drive your weights up to the sky. You've got it, one count down. One count up, maybe you alternate your sides, but keep your narrow squat going. Inhale, lower. Exhale, lift, I am so proud of you guys. Stay strong, stay low through your legs, just for six. Yes, you can stay with me for four. Keep it up for three, just two, and one. Drop it down to your weights. We've got booty bounces. Inhale, lower down to hover. Exhale, lift, cross body punch. Inhale, lower down. Exhale, lift. Here's a side angle view for you. Playing through your knees. Engage a whole bunch through your core. Lower to a hover. Cross body punch. Lower to a hover. Cross body punch. Maybe you alternate which arm you punch first and second. Yes, you can. Glutes literally come to a hover over your heels. Engage a whole bunch through your quads. Whole bunch through your low core, rib cage and inch together. You've got this, inhale, lower down. Exhale, lift, cross body punch. Find your intensity at the top. Trust yourself, trust this process, you're not here for long. You've got a 10 more reps. Whew, you guys look good. Stay strong for five. Yes, you can, give me four. Finish it out for three, just two, and one. Exhale, release your weight to the top of your mat. Step back, find your high plank. You've got oblique knee drives, alternating sides. Take a wide stance through your feet. Inhale, high plank. Whew, exhale, drive your right knee towards your right tricep. Inhale, high plank. Exhale, left knee, left elbow. Alternate from your right to your left. Yes, you can. Strong through your core. Know that you can always take this down to your forearms. Drive your knee. Drive your knee. Engage a whole bunch through your obliques. Here's a side knee for your right there. Flat back, knee drives. Hips stay right at shoulder height the entire time. Yes, you can. You're not here for long. Trust yourself. You can do this, you are strong enough. Inhale, lengthen. Exhale, crunch and drive. Maybe you start to hold it for just a second and then drive your heel towards the back of the room. Yes, you guys look so good. Stay with me, you can, just for six. Stay in your high plank in four. High plank in three, just two and one. Rock it all the way up, capture your weights, use them as stilts. Ground down through your left foot. Send your right leg back on for teeter totters. Inhale, lower down. Exhale, lift, squeeze your glutes at the top. Little drop. Squeeze, you've got this. Ground down through your left foot. Active through your right. Then know that you can always ditch one or both of your weights. Maybe you take your hands to heart center. Maybe you just take one hand to one weight. Challenge yourself right here. Just because you're home doesn't mean you don't have to stop challenging yourself. Dig just a little bit deeper. Trust this right here, you can sink lower. You can take this even slower through your right leg. Whew, you can, deep inhales, sharp exhales. Stay strong through your standing leg. 
You've got this. Little lower. Lift at the top. Back knee literally comes to a hover. Little drop. Squeeze. Drop. Squeeze. You can do this for five. Yes, you can. Give me four. We switch sides in three. Just two. And one. Switch sides. Plant your right foot down. Extend your left leg back. Long teeter totters opposite side. And no lower. Exhale. Lift. This time elongate through your left toes. Ground down through all four corners of your right foot and then see if you can take the same option on the other side as you did on the very first side. Maybe one hand comes to heart center. Lighter grip, use just your fingertips on your weights and get, continue to engage through your core, lift up through your chest. You can do this, inhale lower down. Exhale, lift up, stay tall. One count down, one count up. Yes, 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 I know you guys are rocking this at home. I'm starting to sweat right here, right now, so I'm sure you guys are doing the same. Keep it up just for five. Whew, you can do this for four. Just for three. Last two. And one. Exhale, step it back. Capture both of your weights. Ground down through your right foot. You've got a curtsy lunge. Knee drive. You've got a curtsy lunge. Knee drive up. Ground down through your right foot. Active through your left. Your left knee is going to come to a hover on the side of your mat. And then actively drive your knee up towards your chest. Continue to flex through your toes the entire time. Weights are a heart center. Inhale, lower. Exhale, lift. Knee drive. Yes, you guys are rocking this. One count down. One count up. Really challenge yourself to stay low on your right side. Left knee's going to literally come to a hover. And then as you find the energy, drive up your knee to your chest. Engage through your low core as you drive your knee up. You've got this for five. We take it to the opposite side in four, just three, for two, and one. You've got to ground up through your left foot. Take it right into your right. Inhale, lower, curtsy. Exhale, lift, knee drive. Inhale, lower. Exhale, lift. Flex through your toes. Engage through your low core. Give this side the same amount of love, the same amount of intensity as you did on the other side. Your legs are going to catch a little bit of a break after this. So stay low through your front leg, 90 degree bend. Yes. Yes, yes, yes. I'm so proud of you guys. See, go a little bit lower for five. You can for four. Step to the top of your mat in three. Find your chair pose in two and one. Both your feet step together. Hinge forward. Drop your weights down in front of you. Upright row. Inhale, lower. Exhale, lift. Drop it down. Lift it up. Weights just graze the front side of your body. Here's the side view slide. Hinge forward through your body. Engage through your glutes. Engage through your core. Find a half seat at the top. Shoulder blades squeeze. Slow and controlled. One count down. One count up. Whew, catch your breath. Inhale, lower. Exhale, lift and squeeze. You've got this. Stay with me right here. For four. Can you slow this motion down? You can for three. Take it down to your mat in two. And one. Drop it down to your mat. Find your high plank. You've got walking planks. Walk it up to the top. Drop it down, forearm plank. Walk it all the way up, high plank, forearm plank. So you can alternate which arm you drop down, which arm you lift up. Here's the side view for you right here. We take it up to our high planks, lower down, forearm plank. Up to our high plank, lower it all the way down. I love the option to take a super wide stance through your legs right here so that you can maintain the stability through your hips. Challenge yourself to isolate through your hips. Take it just into your upper body. Little bend, big press. Core is so, so tight right here. Heels come up and over the balls or if you hinge forward even more than you think you can. I promise you're not going to fall over. You've got this little lower. Lift and squeeze. Lower it down. Lift and squeeze. You can. Hips are stable. Just for six. Stay strong for four. Just three. Whoo, for two. And one. Pop it all the way up on your feet. You've got star jack. Shake it all out. Inhale, lower. Exhale, lift. These are my absolute favorite cardio verse. But know that you can always take your right down to a jumping jack, maybe even a cross jack. This is your moment right here. You've got 20 seconds. I want you to dig a little bit deeper. Second major cardio burst of this class. You can do this. Yes, you can. Maybe your head's even hitting your ceiling at home. Like, that's amazing. Stay strong. Stay with me for 10 seconds. Whoo! You guys look so good. Give me five for four. Step it out in three, just two, and one. You got it. 30 second break. Grab a sip of water. Keep yourself on the paddle back because you guys just crushed round, two rounds. Towel off. Tell your neighbor they're rocking it. If you've got a neighbor in your house that you've talked in to do this workout, I'm so glad they're here. So glad they joined us. Ha. 
So proud of you guys. We start back up in 15 seconds on round three. You guys have made it so far. Stick with me. Grab both of your weights in 10 seconds. We take it right into a deadlift in four. Give me three for a two and one short stance deadlift. So you're gonna play through the left foot and then your right toes are gonna to tap right towards the back side of your left ankle. Inhale, lower, slow and controlled glute shoot back. Exhale, lift and press. Inhale, lower. Exhale, lift, stay strong through your upper body. Belly button hugs up and in to protect your low back. Here's the side view, plant through your left toes. Plant through your right, inhale, lower. Exhale, lift. Right toes are just slightly behind your left foot. Feel the engagement through your glutes. And take this at your own pace. Listen to your body a whole bunch right here. I need a flat back. Belly button hugs up in it. Shoulders roll up and back. If you feel yourself having a death grip on your weights, relax the tension through your fingers. Inhale, lower. Exhale, lift. You've got it. One count down. One count up. Squeeze your glutes at the top. Inhale, lower down. Exhale, lift. Stay strong. You've got 10 more reps on this side. Deep inhales. Sharp exhales. Find your chair position in three. Chair pose in two. And one, find your chair pose, hinge forward, glue your feet down onto your mat, weights come next to your hips, inhale to repair. Exhale, lift, tricep kick backs, one count down. One count up, you've got it, inhale lower. Exhale, lift. Oh yeah, maybe you alternate your arms on this one. Maybe you keep one arm high, drive it in, extend it up. Whatever you do, keep your triceps working and burning. Yes, you can, weight stop right at your hips, pinky shoot high. Move this weight. Work directly into your triceps. All the movement's gonna come through your rear elbow to your wrist. Inhale, bend. Exhale, press. Little bend, thumbs to pockets, pinkies to sky. You've got this, thumbs down to pockets, pinkies to the sky. Woo! Breathe into your triceps. Yes, they can handle this, they are strong enough. One count down, one count up. You can't sink one inch lower through your legs. Oh yeah, I see you guys sinking so low at home. Stay with me for six. Yes, you can, give me four. We take it to our opposite side in three, just two, and one. This time, ground down through your right foot. Take a short stance through your left toes. We take a short stance deadlift. Inhale, lower down. Exhale, lift up. Inhale, lower. Exhale, lift, glue through your right foot. Tight slight step back through your left knee. Glute shoot towards the back of the room. Inhale, lower. Exhale, lift. Notice how I still have a flat back here. Weights just glide down in front of my body. Shoulder blades pull up and in towards the back of the room. One down, one up, super slow and controlled. Listen to your body right here, right now. It's super important to listen to your body when you're doing deadlifts because it can be so much on your body. So hug your core up and in. If you can only lower just a little bit, lower just a little bit and then pull it back up. You're still gonna be working your body, you've got this. One count down, one count up. Shoulder blades roll up and back. You can, just for five. Stay strong for four. Even out your side, last few reps for three. Just two. And one, drop your weights down to your mat, take it all the way down, find a lifted tabletop. I'm gonna give you a side view right here. Tabletop, lift up through your knees. Take it, tap down, squeeze, tap, squeeze. You've got it, so you're still in your 90 degree bend through your legs, but your, curl, your toes are curled under. Shoulders still stack over your wrist. Little tap, lift and squeeze, tap, lift and squeeze. You've got this. <clears throat> Stay strong. I want you to start to feel this into your low core. Yes, you can. Press firmly through all 10 fingers on your mat. Micro bend through your elbows. Maintain your flat back and then elongate through the crown of your head. You've got this little tap down. Lift and squeeze. It's a small movement, but I promise you it's gonna catch up with you. One count down. One count up, pull it up and in. Inhale, lower. Exhale, lift. Whew, you guys are doing so good. Stay with me. <clears throat> little tap. Squeeze, tap, squeeze. You can just for four. We pop it up onto our feet in three, pop it up to your feet in two, and one. Pop it all the way up, capture both of your weights. You've got a pec deck lateral lunge, so point your toes and your knees straight ahead. Arms come up to 90 degrees, inhale, lower down. Exhale, lift, arms come up and out. Inhale, lower together. Exhale, lift and squeeze, alternating from right and left sides. As you lower down, shoot your glutes back in the now. Continue to point your knees and your toes straight ahead. Know that you can always take this down to a low rotator. Yes, palms up, weights up if you take this option. Whatever you do, keep on breathing, keep on moving. You can do this. You guys have made it so incredibly far. We're almost to the end of our third circuit. And the end of class is starting to creep up. So continue to sink down low through your legs. 
Zip up through your inner thighs at the top. Yes, you can. Whew, we take it just to the right in four, just the right in three, for two and one, and inhale lower, and lift just the right, a little lower. Squeeze, lower, squeeze. We switch to the left in four. Take it to the left in three. Keep your upright rows going in two and one. You gotta take it to the left, inhale lower. Exhale lift, yes, super strong through your pec decks. Maintain your 90 degree bend, you've got this for five. Whoo, weights come down in four. Just three, drop it down to your mat in two. And one, drop it all the way down to your mat, find a bridge pose. Plant the palms of your feet down, lift your hips high. Take your arms up and out to 90 degrees for a chest press. Inhale to prepare. Exhale, lift, weights tap. Inhale, lower down, glutes to hover. Exhale, lift and extend. Elbows come to a hover, glutes come to a hover. And then punch everything high towards the sky. I'm gonna take it to a side view for you right here. Inhale, lower down. Exhale, lift and press. Whew, deep inhales, sharp exhales. Rib cage still knits together, belly button drills up and towards your spine. One count out, one count up. You can do this. Stay strong with your breath. Stay strong through your legs, ground on through all four corners of both of your feet. Little tap, lift and squeeze, hips press high to the sky. Inhale, lower, exhale, lift. You guys look so good. Stay with me. You can deep inhales, sharp exhales. We stay on our backs in five. Ditch both of your weights in four. Just three for two. And one, ditch both of your weights next to your side. Plant your palms underneath your glutes, extend your legs up the wall. Inhale, lower, double leg, lower and lift. Exhale, lift, reverse crunch at the top. Double leg, lower and lift, inhale, lower. Exhale, lift, double reverse crunch at the top. Flex through your toes. Stamp your heels high to the sky. Yes, you can do this. A little bit of core work right here. Option to lift your head, neck, and shoulders off your mat if you want to tap into your low core just a little bit more. Option to take your fingertips behind your ears. Maybe you glue your palms underneath your glutes for a little bit more support. Continue to protect your low back right here. You've got this. Inhale, lower down. Exhale, lift up. Yes, yes, yes. You've got 10 more reps. Don't miss it. Emphasize your inhales. Emphasize your exhales. It's going to help power you through this last little bit of core work. We pop it up in four. You've got a round of cardio in three. Ankles in two. And one, you've got to hug your knees into your chest. Good rock and roll up. Take it high to the sky. Inhale, lower. Knees to chest. Exhale, lift, ankle at the top, jump it high. Inhale, lower down. Exhale, lift, know that I also just left the option for a squat. Lower it back down, ankle, squat. Whoo, you've got it, 20 seconds right here. Make this your best 20 seconds yet. Yes, you can, inhale, roll, roll it down. Exhale, lift, bring it high to the sky. Stay with me, you can do this. You guys look so, so good. Inhale, lower, rock and roll. Exhale, lift. We land on our feet for just a little bit of cardio to finish this fit class off in four. Stay high on your feet in three. Find your high knees in two and one. You've got to stay high. High knees. Drive your knees to your chest. Flex through your toes. Maybe you take your fingertips high to the sky. We're going to finish this off the best way we know how. And for, for anyone that knows me knows that I love cardio. So we're going to have just a little bit of a cardio cardio for the last few minutes and then cool down us at your doorsteps. Come on, dig just a little bit deeper for your high knees. Keep it up for 10. Yes, you can. We've got squat top downs in four. Squat top downs in three, two, and one. You've got to inhale lower. Exhale lift. Little tap. Drive your legs together at the top. Stay low for your legs. Woo! Yes, you can. Know that you can always just take this to a quickened wide squat. Little tap. Squeeze. Tap. Squeeze. Take whatever you need right here, right now. Whatever you do, keep your body moving. You're almost out of this. Stay with me. Inhale lower. Exhale lift. Yes, you can. Can you speed it up just a little bit? Can you sink a little bit lower through your top downs? Maybe you actually top your mat for the last 10 seconds. Woo! Yes, 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 give me seven. We take it to our jumping jacks in five. Jack it out in four, three, two, and one. You've got to jack it out. Inhale, lower. Exhale, lift. Chest up, chin up. Know that you can always take this into star jacks if you're feeling it today. Ow, ow! Oh, yes, stay strong at home. You can do this. Inhale, lower down. Exhale, lift, grow even taller. Oh, you guys are almost out of this. 15 more seconds. We cool it down. You can, you're already down to 10. Stay strong. How many more reps can you get in? Give me five. For four, three, two, and one. Inhale, mountain pose, top back of your mat. Take a deep breath in. Exhale, many back in. Inhale, mountain. Exhale, lift. 
exhale, many back bend. Inhale, mountain. Exhale, start to slowly walk your fingertips to the top of your mat. Hold your high plank for a second. Walk your fingertips all the way back. You've got inch from slow your breath. Roll all the way up. Lower it all the way down. Walk it out, find your high plank. Crawl it all the way back. Roll it all the way up. Relax your shoulders each and every time. Feel the stretch through the back of your hamstrings. Feel how different this feels now than how your body felt at the very beginning of class. Inhale, lower, walk it all the way down. Exhale, lift, walk it all the way back. Grow even taller through your mountain pose, even prouder, even stronger than when you started class. Yes. Love the breath work. Slow your breath. Slow your heart rate. You're gonna make it, you're almost to the end. Hold your high plank in four. Find your high plank in three, two, and one. Take a deep breath in. Exhale, drop your knees down to your mat. Rock and roll all the way around, kind of butterfly stretch. Plank the palms, your feet together, drop your knees out wide. Inhale, lengthen through the crown of your head. And exhale, forward fold. Take a deep breath in. Exhale, let it go. Extend your left leg long. Drag your right knee in towards your chest. Give it a tight squeeze. Lift your right foot up and over your left. Inhale, lengthen through your left fingertips. Exhale, twist up and over towards the right. Kind of supine twist. On each other, inhale, lengthen through the crown of your head. And each other, exhale, twist just a little bit deeper. So really shake it all out. This time hug your left knee to your chest. Pinch your left foot over your right. Inhale, reach your right fingertips high. Exhale, twist up and over towards the left side. your exhale, shake it all out. Inhale, reach your fingertips high one last time. Exhale, forward fold. On your next breath, roll all the way up. I am so incredibly proud of you and so happy that you came to take this class with me today. Um, my name is Bree. I hope to see you guys all back on this platform sometime soon. Have a great rest of your day.